<laughs> We're off to Bali! We're at the airport now. We're very early, but I think that's best because I didn't really feel like running for an international flight today. I've gotten an Aperol spritz, as I always say. Oh, yum. Tastes like vacay. Oh, is it yum? Yeah, it's not really vacay unless you get a drink. Mmm. Oh my god. Whenever I drink an Aperol, I just feel like I'm in Europe. We've gone to McDonald's for lunch. Oh. Here she is. I don't know if it's like the whole thing. I've gone with an aioli wrap. Mmm, that's good. So for some reason, Jess isn't in the seat next to me. We have woken up in absolute paradise. Oh my camera keeps fogging up. Woken up with a bung eye, so. Why does this happen to me? Anyway, we're just gonna live, laugh, love. Oh my god, I feel so cute. So nice. So cute. Aww, little puppers, little fluffy puppers. Oh, and there's something to do with the pillow. I'm really keen to go to the convenience store later and get like snacks and shit. Can you tell me what you've got? Um, it's going to give me immunity okay. or I drink it. everything away. <laughs> Before it turns into a vodka shot. Oh, same reaction though. Nice. I've gone with an iced oat latte. It's actually pretty good. I usually have an equal, equal, equal. Oh my god, I can't speak. I don't have them here, so I've got to get used to having big girl coffees. Thanks so much. Good. I got eggs and Benny. Oh, that looks yum. That's so gross. cool. She's meant to be free, but not for this holiday. <laughs> she's, on, she's taking a day off. That's for the future, just to worry about. She's taking a day off from being gluten free. Or a week or two. Mmm. Mmm. That baby is so good. This is potentially one of my favorite shops in Bali. It's literally just a candy oh, shop. Look how cute this is. We are definitely children. Oh, imagine this just. Oh, imagine it's just, so cute. You could just have this you next to your, your bed, though. Oh my god, I want to put my lollies in it that I buy. I actually don't get this. I've never oh, seen this. Oh, it must just be like sherbet stuff. Oh, look at all this. The Jelly Belly Wall is my favorite. Out doing some shopping in Chengdu. About to explore. What's this place called? We just went on our first bike ride. I loved it. That's, wait, we're also, my driver. That's my driver. Driving away. Bye, Shardy. Also, I became um, best friends of mine. I used to know his family. And then he showed me all the pictures. Wait, my bags are on there. What oh, bag? my God. My, my shopping bags. Oh, no. Fuck me. Wait. I don't know. I don't know. All my stuff. But he wouldn't have wanted it. It was like a, dr a crochet dress. Well, that's my stuff gone. I don't have his number or anything. It was an accident. I don't know what to do. Basically, so I just left all of my shopping on that motorbike, but luckily he, he did he realize or did you find him? He was on his way back and I was running. Tina was about to have a meltdown. Oh my God, because we literally just went all the way to Changu. Like it was like a two hour round journey just so I could get this swimsuit. If we had to go back, I might have just flown home. I couldn't have handled that. We're off to get a massage. Jess's favorite place. Oh, I'm gonna here. Little doors are so cute. Oh, this is nice. Wow. Stunning. Wouldn't be in Bali unless I had a cocktail and we also got some nasi goreng. I love prawn crackers. <laughs> I requested not spicy because I'm a little bitch. Mm -hmm. Just had the nicest afternoon. We went and had like a full body massage. I almost fell asleep. I was feeling total zen afterwards. And then we got some lunch and now I'm gonna go for a dip in the pool. This is honestly so nice. I usually always stay in resorts. Like I don't do villas. This is the first villa I've ever stayed in in Bali. Oh. I've got a blister on my foot from walking around in those sandals and I can feel it stinging in the water so that's going to be fun for the rest of the holiday. <laughs> Went to the mini mart and this is a bit of a food haul because I bought heaps of stuff because I love when you go overseas and they have all these yummy foods that I've never tried before. First we got this massive water because you can't drink the water here otherwise you might put yourself. First 
Twisted roast corn. It looks really yummy and because it's corn. Next, I don't know what these are. Caramel popcorn chew things. Cheeky balls. Curious Choco. They kind of look like Milo balls and I love Milo. And it, it, it intrigued me that it's in a chip packet, but it's sweet. So that's why I got these. Take it, take, tuck it, tuck, take it. They look like little Kit Kats. This is the green tea flavor. Lollies. Jess wanted these apple ring lollies, so they better be good. And then Millie Moos. I don't know. I just felt like I should try them. This is, I actually don't even know, a coconut drink, but it looks like it kind of has some kind of like jellies inside. We are going out for drinks and dinner at Motel Mexicola, but I'm not going to bring my camera because <laughs> too many things have happened today. First, I left my phone in a bathroom and a woman had to look at my lock screen to find out who owned the phone that left it in the bathroom. It was me, of course. Second, I left all of my shopping on a motorbike, so I'm not allowed to bring the camera out. The camera's not coming out, but... Most of Mexico should be really fun. They do like really yummy Mexican and drinks. Do you reckon it'll be like people go out tonight there? Like, probably why we're going later, right? This is my outfit. I just have white shorts. This little top is from IMG, and this little bolero is from Beginning Boutique. And slides because I'm gonna live in slides. Floss. Wow. I'm going to live in slides for the rest of my time here in Bali. Day two of Bali. We went to Motel Mexicola last night and we did have a lot of cocktails, but I'm pretty impressed because I feel good right now and I had enough self-control to send myself home because we've got a big day today. We're going to go to the Kind Cafe. It's like a plant-based cafe. I'm so excited. And then this afternoon tonight, we're going to Surveya to see Rufus and I'm so excited. Never been to Surveya before. It's in Uluwatu, but it looks absolutely insane. We're at Kind Cafe, it's like a plant-based cafe, and I've got in this Choco Loco smoothie drink. It's absolutely delicious. And Jess got like a watermelon. What is it? A watermelon juice? Watermelon. Is it yummy? Yeah. Yum. How cute is it in here? The yeah. stuff. Mmm, pancakes. What, what is that though? I don't know, it's like a marshmallow. It's happening. Marshmallow? Oh my gosh. <gasps> wow. Okay, food art. Got excited and ordered a bit of everything because we wanted to try. These were like these pancakes. I don't really know what they were, but it's plant based. This is meant to be like, what is, wait, what is this? Cheese toasty. Yes! Cheese. Bacon and cheese toasty. Bacon and cheese toasty. Big brekkie and then an avo toast with a fake egg. And I'm just so I'm intrigued by this. Like, this isn't a real egg. How is that possible? We're both getting pedicures done now. Yeah, I feel like you definitely needed to get this done right now. <laughs> Wait, when did it snap off? Last night, I felt <laughs> the crack. And I was like, nah. I feel like I don't really need them done, but I just want to chew myself. <laughs> Twenty twenty three, the vlog pause because you actually can't take like cameras into any of the day clubs or anything, and I also don't trust myself with this camera. Anyway, Jess and I have both woken up today, not feeling great, not because we were hungover. Okay, she's a bit. Oh, hello. Uh, it's Bali Belly. I'm pretty sure. It is. I just feel a little bit like nauseous, but I don't know if I'm gonna vomit. So, hopefully we get it at the same time because then it just is better. We only lose like a couple of days. Not lose. You never lose. Every day is a gift. <laughs> Every day is a gift. Every day is a gift. Every day is a gift. 
<laughs> We're going to try go get a drip now. Because home service is booked out because everyone's smarter than us and booked it in beforehand. Oh, well, let's try do this. Uh. No. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Nice. Big girl, big girl. You move my hand. Happening, getting a drip, heal me. I've discovered I really don't like needles. I thought I was okay with them, but <laughs> I don't think I am. There's a pretty little pink drip. I'm hungry, I'm getting hungry, which is maybe a good thing. It just depends if I'll be able to keep it down. Hopefully this does something, because I just want to feel good again. <laughs> <laughs> just finished the IV drip and I do feel a little bit better like now I feel like eating something so I think we're gonna go out and try to find some food whenever I feel sick though like the only thing I want to eat is spaghetti so now I'm on a mission to find some spaghetti we made it out of the house for dinner I feel like I've kind of taken a turn at dinner but it's fine I've gotten a spaghetti bolognese because it's literally the only thing I ever feel like when I'm sick Jess has just gone for the chippies. The chippies in a spray. We are back and alive, Bali day four. What is it four? I don't know, I'm losing track of the days. Uh, I don't know actually, 28, 29, 30, 31. Finally feeling a little bit better. So we've come out for breakfast. We are at Brett Shelter Cafe and it's really cute. Hey, it's so cute. I really hope this doesn't. Imagine if I was in the cab. This is the first meal that I'm attempting to eat from my barley belly. It's an avo toast. I was a bit sus on the Greek yogurt situation, so I've got it on the garlic side. Garlic yogurt. Oh, garlic yogurt. That's mm. why I'm saying don't do that, Shadi. Yeah, I just want to see. And then I got this iced tea drink, which is also probably daring. I don't know why I'm really trying my luck today. So we were meant to be going to Gilly Tea today, but last night we got told that the water was going to be too rough. And too rough! Yeah, apparently the waves were going to be like two meters and that sounds like a lot. Um, but yeah, so the port was closed and we already had accommodation and everything booked. So last night we were in a panic on our deathbeds trying to figure out what the hell we we're going to do. But we've ended up in Uluwatu and we found the nicest place. Are you ready for the tour? It is literally so stunning. Oh my god. This is our little pool. <laughs> our bed. Wait, Romantic it? little swans. That's my seated area for when I want to chillax. Then you come out here. And you've got two little sinks. There's two showers out here, like outdoor showers. Bath, which looks so lush. Little bathroom. And yeah. I guess it'll do. <laughs> I love it. It's actually really nice. It's actually nice. so nice. Yeah. I'm glad that and we got somewhere Gilly, nice. Gilly, we were going to be staying in a little hut, which was cute. And obviously it would have been beautiful, but if it was going to be rough, then kind of all the activities that we wanted to do, yeah. we wouldn't have been able to. So it's probably better that we didn't go and then it got really shit in the water. Well, imagine if we went yesterday and because they only closed it today, like if we actually could have got stuck on the island. So things could be worse. And look at this stunning paradise. Paradise, paradise. Mm. Last night we went out for a really nice dinner at Rolling Fork. It's an Italian place and it was so yummy. I got like this ravioli, just got a spaghetti and it was the first meal that I didn't vomit up, so that was 10 out of 10 for me. And now we're on our way to get some brekkie. We're going to Owl's Cafe. Hi. Hey. These are the vegan pancakes and they look delicious. Shotties. Just remember, when you think you got Bali Belly and you're down, you might die. You're not going to. Look at where we are. 
Please excuse my luggage. I have just taken over this side of the room with my luggage and then Jess has this side. So it's like an organized chaos, which pretty much describes our whole lives. We are going out to dinner tonight. The restaurant is called Taboo. Taboo? Taboo. The restaurant is called Taboo. I can't remember what cuisine it is, but it looked pretty good. Asian and Mexican. This is the outfit. It's a set from One Mile and I've done a little bun. And we're just waiting for our drivers because don't really feel like walking around in the dark like we did last night. It's a little bit scary. I was like, I'm one second away from being axe murdered. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> we are off to Ulu Cliff House. I've stolen Jess's bandana because we have a communal closet. Um, and yeah, we're gonna... Ooh, sorry, I what? just realized I might change my... I brought two hats. You guys wanna tell me what hat? Well, you're not gonna be able to tell me, but... This one? The other one. Oh. Oh. No, this... Anyway, we're going to day club. <laughs> but in the day clubs, you're not allowed to take cameras, so I haven't really been able to film anything in there, so... I'm gonna leave this at home because it's just annoying bringing my camera when I can't even film anything inside. And if the quality goes bad, it's because I'll probably just film Ooh, some it's fine. Yeah, it's cute. I'll probably just film on my phone. Anyway, we're off to the beach club. Sorry. Look at the weather. It was literally pouring down rain this morning, but now it's looking lush. Packing dance. We are at, where are we? We're at Pamela Beach Club. The blue sky has come out for us once again. It's our last day in Uluwatu before we go back to Chenggu. So we're just gonna have some drinks, some nibbles and chillax. Um, live our best life by the pool. Hey. <laughs> Cassava pasta, whatever cassava is. Looks yummy. Is it vegan or veggio? Mm. Vegan. Looks yum. We've arrived back in Changu and we're on a mission. <laughs> we're on a mission to get Jess's lip waxed. It's been the mission of the whole trip. <laughs> yeah, all the while to everywhere was booked out and then they have no lip wax anywhere. So I feel like that should be the easiest thing to find in Bali, like a lip. Well, Nope, it's not. Turns out waxing's harder than you think, so <laughs> um, it has to get sorted. I don't know if this is the right direction. I feel like it is. we're in the back streets. It is. <laughs> we're getting ready to go to dinner and we've decided that we're going to go to this club which is like techno because that's our bread and butter. Billy's basically out. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> My voice is like got <laughs> crazy. Uh, oh, she's fogging up. And now we're heading to breakfast at our hotel. It's a rainy day, so I'm not really sure what we're gonna do today. This is this morning's breakfast. You could like pick from like your protein and your carbs and stuff. So I've gone with a wrap because I'm gonna make all of this into a wrap. Hmm. Well, I feel like this is not gonna even fit in my wrap. toast. Oh, is the egg on toast? Oh, okay. Just got a fruit platter. That's actually a really good size fruit platter. Thank you, darling. Oh, oh my god. Wait, the pita bread looks really good too. Mmm, yeah. little pita pocket. I made this couple. 
<laughs> oh yeah. You want it whilst it's happening? Oh. So, oh my god. We left a packet of Doritos and there's just like a whole colony of ants right above where we sleep at night. It's perfect. To be fair, we've been sitting on ants the whole time. Yeah, it's fun. They're locals. Today we had a really chill day. We went to La Brissa and had a nice lunch. It was really nice. I love that place. It's just like super chill vibes. I always feel really relaxed whenever I'm there and the food is so good. And then we went to some little markets. I got this little dress situation. I was going to wear it tonight, but I'm going to save it because I feel like I could actually wear this out tomorrow night if we go for drinks after dinner. It's like a little mesh sheer thing and I'll wear it with like a black bikini underneath. Anyway, we're going to Yuki for dinner tonight. It's like a Japanese thing, but I think it'll be a chill one because we're a bit hung dog today. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe a cocktail drink. Oh, yum. It feels that's good. so good. What did you get? It's like a vodka. I don't know, something. <laughs> Fruity thing. And then these are. I think these are. This watermelon yeah. and this taco. Yeah. Coming back to the hotel now, and that was honestly. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> that was the best Japanese dinner that I've had in my entire life. Like I reckon that was one of my favorite yeah. places that we've eaten. Everything was so just fresh so and fresh and yummy and everything came out so quickly. She's So mwah, beautiful. My best life for us now. <laughs> life is worth living, but only when it looks exactly like this. I want nothing else but this. <laughs> oh man. The traffic in Bali is so insane. We just got back to our hotel from Uluwatu. We're staying in Changu, and I feel like it shouldn't like. I feel like it would only be if there was no traffic, like half an hour. It's not that far in distance, but it literally took, <laughs> I want to say like over two hours getting home. We had the best afternoon at Sunday's Beach Club. So nice. The sun was out. There was blue skies. I think it rained for like a few seconds, but then it went away and it was just blue skies. We even got to go snorkeling and we saw these little fishies in the water. It was just such a nice spot. If you're in Uluwatu, definitely pop down to Sunday's. I've been wanting to go for ages because I didn't get to go last time so it was nice that we got to go and it was actually sunny this time tonight we are going to dinner at mason and then i think we might go back to motel mexicola because we've only got a couple nights left so we want to make the most of it i pop in some things about dinner because i feel like it's gonna be delicious this whole trip has mostly just been me eating out and drinking cocktails and i wouldn't change a thing once again this is looking very similar to when we're in the Gold Coast, so just ignore it. But <laughs> this is tonight's outfit. I just want to say, this was the first thing I bought in Bali, and I went into a store and I paid over $100 for it, and then I proceeded to see it in every single market, probably for $10 for the rest of the trip. It's finally getting a rinse tonight. I feel like it's cute. I don't know about this, how this is going to go, but for now. It's cute. Jess is also in yellow. <laughs> shoddy, shoddy. We're on our way to breakfast. It's day 11. Wait, is it day 11? Mm. That doesn't sound right. Wait, 28, 29, 30. 30. Wait, we've been here a while. <laughs> and it's our last night tonight. We're leaving tomorrow, so we still get like a full Wah! day tomorrow. Wah! I reckon I could do another week. I could do another week. I don't want to go back to Sydney. I don't want to go back to school. I don't want to go back to work. I don't want to go back to my life. I love it here. <laughs> We're going to breakfast now. We're going back to the vegan, the plant-based cafe that we went the other day. The secret spot. But my tummy is doing things this morning. But I don't actually think it's barley belly. I think it's the fact that I just drank like seven different kinds of alcohol last night. So, mm, could be it. <laughs> 
We're about to head out for dinner to go to the lawn, but I want to show you, this is the little black dress thing I got the other day. I actually feel like I'm wearing it back to front, but we're in Bali, so we can get away with it. It's cute. It's our last day in Bali and we're really sad about it. We're walking to get a massage now because I just want to be completely relaxed leaving this place. Although, if I was any more relaxed, I'd be moving backwards through time. But <laughs> we've literally done nothing but like lie in the sun for like the past two weeks. So, yep, we're getting a massage today. And then our flight is, we have a red eye flight. So we're actually in Bali for like a full day before going. So we're just gonna go get a massage, go to Mississippi and enjoy our last day. How cute is this little spot where we're getting out? Oh my God, oh my God, so loud. This is so cute. Oh, hello, do you work here? Yeah, hey. <laughs> Getting in the final moments of R and R with Pop Tower. We're at Mississippi. Such a vibe here. How do you I feel? Am so sad. Basically, <laughs> um, it doesn't really feel like we're leaving because we're at the day club right now. But maybe we were, I'll we do definitely a, cry at the airport. Check in later. I'll definitely cry on the plane, and I'll be crying tomorrow when I'm at home. It won't be screaming kids on the plane. It'll be us. I'm not leaving. <laughs> oh, don't make me leave, please. It's the end, the end of the Bali era. Oh, no. I didn't know if it was possible to get Bali Belly twice, but I've gotten it twice, and I, my body chose to get it now. So it's been really fun. Six hour flight. If you don't hear from me again, if you don't hear from me again, they opened up the plane doors and they shoved me out. Which is <laughs> 